college right now. And unlike Toby, I didn't really know what I wanted to do exactly in high school. I did a lot of different things. I continued with all my classes in high school, so I didn't specialize in any of the sciences or history or anything like that. I just kind of wanted to get a well-rounded high school and I kind of wanted that to continue into college. So I mostly focused on liberal arts schools, ones that had a core education where you had to continue and take some math or and science, English, all of that, just so that I got exposure to all of those things because I wasn't sure exactly where I wanted to go. I didn't think I wanted to go into any of the STEM fields as much, but I still wanted to kind of keep an open mind. And so in high school, I did theater. I did, was in a, a couple different clubs. Uh, I really enjoyed doing those, and those are some of the things that, as Kobe said, I um, included in a lot of my essays and things that were really important to me uh, and what I kind of wanted out of my college experience. And so my dad is a college professor, so I'd kind of grown up going to college campuses. Um, he taught at a couple, couple different schools in the area. And um, so I kind of knew some schools, but I kind of was still looking at what I wanted. And for me, one of the things that was really important was location. I knew that I wanted to be near a city. I think there's a lot of really cool things that you can experience when you're near a city. I knew that I loved museums. I knew I wanted to be able to have those cultural experiences that might not be possible in a smaller town. A lot of my friends chose to go to smaller towns and love them. There's a different, that's a different experience that you're gonna get, and so you really have to kind of think about what you want out of it. Do you want that co smaller college feel where you're gonna be surrounded by college students, or do you wanna be in a larger city with more uh, diverse population? So that's one of the things that, for me, was really important. Another thing I looked at was size, which doesn't sound like a very important thing, um, but it really is gonna impact what your college experience is like, because uh, there's colleges that range from 2,000 students or smaller to really big 10, um, 20,000 uh, students. So it really, that's one of the things that for me was important. I knew that I wanted something kind of in the middle, so Boston College is a little over 9,000, and after being there, I've really liked it because I constantly am meeting new people, but I still, uh, have like, we'll see people I know when I walk through the campus, things like that, or um, it's really nice to have that kind of balance, but one of, um, I'm an, I was an RA this past year, and one of my freshmen really wanted a smaller campus experience, so she ended up transferring for that, so that's something that I think it's really important to consider what you guys want um, out of that, what is the environment that you really want to cultivate. Um, I also, I went into Boston College undecided as a freshman, uh, which a lot of people do, um, especially in the United States, because a lot of the schools are, um, you don't apply necessarily to a major and get in that way, but you apply to the school and then have more flexibility. So even if you are applying to a major, you kind of have the chance to like switch, which a lot of my friends who went in pre-med have switched to other majors um, since taking some of those classes. Um, so that's something to think about that you might, especially if you're applying to schools around here, you don't have to know 100% that that's what you want. Um, so for me, it wasn't looking as much at what school, what majors the schools had, as long, long as they had kind of some diversity there. Um, I'm an international studies major now. I really enjoy that because it's interdisciplinary. I can really, um, I get to take a lot of different classes and a lot of different disciplines that all relate to my major. Um, but I know a lot of people also really enjoy concentrating specifically on ones and really delving deeply into a specific subject. So it kind of depends on what you want there. But there is that kind of flexibility, especially in the first couple of years. Most schools are in the area, uh, sought by the end of your sophomore year, you have to decide. But you have a couple of years to kind of have that flexibility, which is really nice. Um, yeah, so I think that's Woo! what I was